choir's conductor is Dr. David Brown, coordinator for the All City Chorus. Please welcome Dr. David Brown. It's really hard to understand anything back there. Um, hi, my name is David Brown. I'm pleased to uh, be the coordinator of this year's All City Chorus event. Um, I'd like to introduce you some important people who have had a, a, wonder, a wonderful impact on these students in preparing for this event. From South High School, Aubrey Dunham. From, from North High School, Ms. Ariel Chastain. From McKay High School, Peter Sepulveda. From McNary High School, Justin Miller. And from West High School, Cole Heole Valenzuela. These are the folks here in Salem at the high school level Corley who make things happen and they've done a wonderful job preparing these students for this event. Let's give them a big hand. Tonight's clinician uh, is a special friend. Um, Dr. Wires and I met for the first time an undisclosed number of years ago uh, in graduate school, and I recognized her immediately as someone who was uh, committed to the choral art, uh, a serious student, um, and yet someone who had a passion for choral music. Um, I have watched her career with great interest as she has uh, developed her skills as a composer, as a teacher, um, as a great mentor uh, and an example of uh, what, we, what we strive to be in the choral art. Um, she's had a, a very storied career that you can read about in her biography in the program. Um, she's actually a Portland native and is a graduate of Cleveland High School, so she's much closer to us than we might think. It is my great pleasure tonight to introduce the 2023 Allstate Chorus under the direction of Dr. Giselle Wires. Sing, man. 
a great pleasure to be here and an honor. We've had a wonderful couple of days together, especially with the partnership of Bethea Glebe. Wonderful, snapping for her now. Our beautiful pianist. So the theme for this concert, I had to choose the music, I think it was like in the late summer. And I thought, it'd be kind of cool, let's do it, because it's going to be the winter, let's do something called like Calm Within the Storm. I don't know, it could be good. And then um, David Brown called me <laughs> the day that I was supposed to leave in my car to come down and said, we've had record snowfall in the Salem area and classes are canceled today and we're basically in snow apocalypse. So it was, it was kind of cool. It was like very meta. We were having this deep sort of experience of, of calm within the storm. Um, but these, these students are, are really quite exceptional. And um, I've, I've had a wonderful time. We aren't done yet. We're going to now actually sing a piece about the wind from um, Shakespeare, Blow Thou Winter Wind. And I, I hope you enjoy the ongoing symbolism.
we've sung in French and Estonian. <laughs> the last piece we'll sing is in English. Um, but we, I wanted to share a little bit about the last couple of days. I mean, these students came impeccably compared, not compared, prepared, <laughs> impeccably prepared. And that made it so much easier considering that we did lose three hours of, of intended rehearsal time. I don't even feel like, like I lost it. We were fine. Um, we were able to have some fun and talk about a lot of different things. I'd like to share some of those things, but first I really want to thank the teachers who were responsible for the preparation and artistry that you see here tonight. I grew up in Portland, as you heard, heard already, and uh, Salem has just such a tradition of excellence with music, and it continues, so it's, it's really pretty exciting. So some of the things that we talked about, um, we worked a lot on musicality and vocal technique. We discussed the meaning of the texts in small groups. Uh, we worked on diction, uh, especially with those foreign languages to try to bring them as close as possible to native speakers. But we also talked a little bit about life after high school and how all of these students can continue to have a lifetime of music making, no matter what career or profession they choose to pursue. Um, a lot of really insightful students up here, very perceptive, very aware of the world that they're walking into and ready, ready to take it on. And I was very moved by that. I would say perceptive, positive, hardworking, creative individuals, extremely musical. That is my assessment of you all. <laughs> All right, calm within the storm, but we're done with the calm part. We're going to get a little wild with Wild Forces by Jake Brunestad. <laughs> 